So, I made this piggyback ECU for my turbo Porsche Boxster, and I'm going to show you how it's made. But first, let's see it in action. Here's a quick overview of the piggyback ECU I made. It's housed in an aluminum case. Um, the actual controller is an Arduino Mega. And this is just a generic screen. Uh, on the screen you can see AFR, boost, uh, the mass airflow, how many knock counts there are, throttle, and the injector status. Uh, up above, these are just gauges I bought, wideband gauges for the right bank air to fuel, left bank air to fuel, and boost. This button controls my intercooler fan. And then on the ECU, I can actually data log all the important parameters by pushing that button. I get an indication of the data logging has started, what log number I'm on, so I can pull it off of the ECU. Also, this button acts as a two-step, so I can fire the injectors when I want to shoot flames out the back. I then wrote an Android app that connects to the, the ECU via Bluetooth. On here, I can do things like select the plot that I want to run on the ECU. This one's air to fuel and injector pulse width. Uh, this one is boost and uh, air to fuel. And then if I go back, it goes to the main screen. I also get diagnostics as far as if my uh, injector startup check has passed to validate that the injectors are working. And other alarms are displayed here as well. I also have settings for uh, running the injector test, all my pulse width uh, values for my left and right injectors and how much uh, fuel I actually want to inject uh, based off of how much boost.
actually controls two injectors, extra injectors, on the manifold, the intake manifold. You can see I made my own uh, aluminum fuel rails for two extra injectors, so I got left and right control. And that ECU, based off of boost, is going to inject extra fuel into this manifold uh, to the left and right bank. I can honestly say I'm very happy with the way the piggyback ECU turned out. I data logged a couple of the runs under full boost and my air fuels are perfect. They're about 12 and a half to one down to about 12. I still have a little bit of tuning left to do. The biggest issue now is I'm putting down so much power that the clutch, the factory clutch can't handle it. So I'm actually going to upgrade it. Um, it's a slight upgrade, a little bit bigger than factory. I think because my car has 50,000 miles on it, the clutch is a little worn out. Uh, so that's the next step. But I can tell you, I'm very, very happy with the way that this whole insole turned out. Uh, I think the fuel rail turned out excellent. Um, the ECU turned out amazing. I've got good, uh, good information on what the car is actually doing. So I think... I, I fixed the problem. I mean, I, I fixed the lean air to fuel ratio uh, issue because the factory Porsche ECU, well, it's really the mass airflow sensor, couldn't read high enough for the amount of power I'm putting through the engine. So it was actually maxing out at five volts, which is as high as the mass airflow sensor can go. And now I can basically get up to 300 horsepower with these two extra 24 uh, pound injectors.